I've, I've been working in reproductive biology, in, spark, in particular with sperm biology, since I was a grad student. Uh, I, the sperm was always like very interesting to me from the very beginning when I saw them moving under the microscope. So uh, I was, uh, uh, I have a particular attraction to understand what are the mechanisms for the sperm to fertilize an egg um, from the male side in particular. And there is uh, like a, a process that is a maturational process that sperm undergo in the female reproductive tract called capacitation. So basically my, my work is uh, related to that process, capacitation, where the sperm acquire the ability to fertilize an egg. And in, in, in this process, I study different, different aspects. Uh, like some, one part of my lab study the, the process called acrosome reaction which is very important to relocalize the proteins that are important for fusion. Um, and the other, the other part of my lab studies signaling molecules that involve like some uh, ion channels and other, other um, signaling kinases uh, that are very important to, uh, to acquire the capacity to fertilize an egg. So basically uh, what we propose to MCI is to look for um, candidates, molecules, that can inhibit one of the most important uh, ion channels in the sperm. This is CATSPER. And CATSPER is a calcium channel that is localized in the, in the flagellum of the sperm <clears throat> and is absolutely essential for fertilization. I mean, it's very clear that mice and, and humans that are, have, uh, do not have CATSPER or, or have like some um, mutations that disrupt the function of CATSPER are completely sterile. So it's a, and it's an ideal candidate for contraception because it's it is only expressed in sperm. So we in that sense we minimize the side effect that we we can have when we use a drug to inhibit that channel. So that's why Catsper is, is a very attractive uh, contraceptive target. And what we propose is to uh, we create. Uh, I mean the. The complication with Catsper to study Catsper is that it's very, it's very, it's a very complex channel. Uh, very complex in the structure of the, the, the structure of the channel is very complex, and we cannot reconstitute in vitro the channel in another cell. So it's very difficult to 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 do screenings uh, with that channel because we have to use the native channel that is in the sperm, and we came up with a, a novel approach. To use like um, to screen multiple drugs, thousands of drugs, uh, using the Catsper that is expressed in the sperm, and this is basically what we propose to to, to MCI to use this new screen method uh, to detect like um, interesting candidates to inhibit the Catsper, and in the second phase we are going to refine. Uh, which is the best candidate in terms of toxicity, selectivity, and all these other uh, features that uh, a good contraceptive needs to have. My hope is that, that we or other groups that are trying to do basically the same thing is that we can find like a certain group of molecules that can inhibit like a very specific sperm process. And that if we can achieve that, we're going to have like a very specific and good uh, contraceptive. Uh, it's going to be very hard, I think, because we have that biological limitation that sperms are producing the male, and, but they do most of their job in the female. So uh, it's, I think it's really challenging to try to block a process in the male that, and that is going to work in the female. So, and another thought that I have is that maybe we need to use like a div, like a combine different approaches uh, instead of instead of like uh, inhibiting one pathway or one channel or one molecule, we can try to use like multiple approaches to have more more effective methods. I think what MCI is doing is amazing uh, in terms of providing funding and trying to to talk to the general audience also to why it's important to have a male contraceptive. Um, before before MCI we didn't have like real real sources of funding to 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 basically uh, discover alternative uh, methods of 
for contraception using the male, the male part. Uh, we have the resources and, and the knowledge to do that. It's just a matter of time and funding to get it done. I mean, there are like very smart people in the field that have very, very novel and good ideas. And with the help of MCI and other sources, I think it's doable. I mean, not that it's not something that we have, uh, it's not uh, science fiction. We can do it. Thank you.